1041 on this Sunday evening going into our work week and today was a beautiful day to get outside as temperatures topped out at 67 degrees. A great January day and taking a look at what's happening for us right now on the satellite radar. Really not a whole lot. We are nice and quiet right now across the Metroplex. Clear skies in place. That's allowing our temperatures to cool off relatively quickly. We're down to about 48 in South Lake to 42 in McKinney to the mid 40s in Mesquite to already 39 in Granbury. And on the wide view, you can see the upper 30s in Bowie, even 36 in Sherman as we have a weak frontal boundary that's going to pass its way through. With it, no precip, but just kind of a reinforcing shot of some cooler air. It is dissipating right overhead. So by the time you wake up tomorrow morning, the winds will be near about maybe 10 miles per hour. Temperatures, though, are going to be in the mid 30s. It's going to feel like about 24 degrees, so you definitely need the coat on tomorrow morning. But then tomorrow afternoon, not too bad. Temperatures about where we're supposed to be for this time of the year, about 54 to 55. Slightly cooler uh, than the average, and cooler than today, definitely with those north winds still breezy near about 15 to 20 miles per hour. On the wide view, really cold air is off to the north, but the next few days, we're going to have warmer air out to the west, build its way east. This trough of low pressure will continue to dig its way off towards the east. So what that means for you is make plans to get outside. At least, again, on Tuesday and Wednesday, it's going to be a bit breezy. Pollen's going to be up there. Probably that mountain cedar count is going to go up one more time. So if you suffer like me, just hang in there. we got to deal with it for about another month. You can see those winds forecast for us about 15 to 25 miles per hour going to Tuesday, Tuesday night into Wednesday, near about maybe 25 to 30 miles per hour, gusting up slightly higher than that. And that's why that fire danger goes up on Tuesday and Wednesday. The red area, the critical fire danger concerns with the south winds at 15 to 25, gusting up to 35. We do have another frontal boundary on the way, so the winds are up ahead of that front. That front pushes through, cools us back down to the mid 60s Thursday into Friday. Your high on Friday, only 49 degrees. And then on Saturday and Sunday, temperatures in the mid 50s. Small rain chances on the way as we go into Sunday, so a little return of some February weather as we round out this work week.